We're in Patagonia, a 400,000 square mile landscape shared between Argentina and Chile. This is one of the world's last wild places, a seemingly inhospitable land that's fascinated travelers for centuries. This is Perito Moreno, one of Patagonia's most famous glaciers. Unlike many glaciers around the world, this massive wall of snow and ice is actually growing, with its ice field advancing two meters per day. To assess the health of a glacier, geologists look for its equilibrium line, or the ratio of snow accumulation versus snow melt. When these two are in balance, like they are for Perito Moreno, a glacier is considered stable. But that's not the case for all glaciers in Patagonia. Many are retreating due to warming temperatures. In Chilean Patagonia, the glaciers that supply Santiago have shrunk by 25% in a 30-year time frame. Some are expected to completely disappear within 15 to 25 years. Much of Patagonia's beauty stems from its unspoiled nature, yet it's still a very fragile place, sensitive to environmental forces and human impact. Which means that it's more than likely that sites like this may not be around forever.